So in the video today, we're leaving beautiful New Zealand and we're heading across the ditch to a completely different landscape. That's right, here we are in Perth, Western Australia. So I'm here to catch up with some friends. My friends, like me, happen to enjoy mixed martial arts of all things. So we were able to catch an incredible event in Perth, a live card. But the other factor was being able to head out into the desert for some aerial photography. On the roads out here, you get a lot of these trucks and you get a lot of these types of views for hours. Yeah, so this is the landscape for about 3,000 k's that way. Yeah, 4,000 k's that way. <laughs> That's why we're getting I in the air. I don't actually know that there is another place on Earth that has quite that consistency no. of landscape for quite, for quite that distance. It's amazing. We're all taking up mid-range and telephoto, essentially. Yep. Sounds good. <laughs> I looked away. <laughs> so thankfully this plane has an incredible photography setup. You can see this window system here. So shooting through the window is not a problem at all. We don't have to worry about reflections or anything like that. And there's no strut either. So you've got a nice open view there. One of the main challenges today though is the wind that we had. We had some pretty decent wind which made for quite a bumpy turbulent flight. Now it's one thing to be able to stomach that but it's another to be able to look through a lens at two, three, four hundred millimeters and accurately line up your compositions and that was one of the main challenges we faced. You can see here the beautiful landscape, so bizarre, incredibly abstract. Now the white lakes are where the water is completely evaporated out and the colours are coming from where there's a thin layer of water filled with all that salt. And that's what we were really trying to capture. So you get an idea of the movement here, everything bouncing around. <laughs> so it was quite a challenge. Obviously it's very bright, so getting a fast enough shutter speed is not a problem at all. It's just being able to line up those compositions, which it's always a challenge when you do aerial photography. Um, it's just a part of the game. You can see how incredibly alien this landscape is. It's, it's really bizarre and such a pleasure to photograph it. Look at this perspective here as we're coming around. You can see that, that bouncing movement. Dylan's trying his best to line up the shot. Guys fly more than me, so I could start to feel in my lower belly. It was like, was breakfast a good idea this morning? <laughs> Ten minutes there, every time I looked at my screen, or every time I come back and go, oh. Yeah. 